Hello everyone, and welcome back to one of Let's Play's Blind Edition, where the series where I play games requested by other people. If you don't know about it, watch the channel trailer. <laughs> anyway, I'm playing Stuart Little Free Big Photo Adventure, a PS2 game requested by Harry TM12, and apparently it works with the eye toy. <laughs> That's different. Because I was just looking at the box just then. Let's just delve right into this one, shall we? Because I have no idea what the hell this is about. From what I've heard, though, this game is not well, it's not one of the best games of all time, but it's decent, I think, anyway. Well, I don't know, let's just find out, shall we? By creating a save date on my memory card. Good god, I'm gonna have to play lots of memory on that thing later. There's actually literally a memory card dedicated to this series. <laughs> this is what I use for not only my spare time, but for my series as well. But still. Loading. Again. Are they quick, the load times, or are they quite slow? That took like five seconds, that wasn't bad. Oh dear, not again. Oh no! Hey, Stuart, are you okay? I think so, George. But there's a problem. Oh, no. The photo album for my school project, it's ruined. I'm so sorry, George. Sheesh! Look, bats fly, mice don't. When are you gonna learn? It's okay, Stuart. I'll just have to take them all again. No. No, you won't. It's my fault, and I'll fix it. I'll retake all your photos myself. Oh, but we'll help you, won't we, Snowbell? Yeah, yeah. For a price. Here we are in the garden, the place you're gonna start replacing those photos. Some should be real easy, and others, <laughs> well, let's just say I'm real glad it's you doing this and not me. Remember though, you don't need all of the photos to finish the project. And once you've got enough of them, then I can take you on to new areas of the neighborhood. To take a photo, you're gonna have to power up the flash on your camera. Power comes in two sizes small sparks, and big charges. Collect enough, and you get flashes for your camera. Now, to start you off on your little mission, I can help you with your first photo. Your first photo is of me. To take this shot, you need to run over to the photo medallion over there. Pick up any sparks or charges you find on the way to power your camera. Go do that while I compose myself. Right, you can now move the viewfinder of your camera up, down, left, and right until the shot is perfect. I'll even talk you through this shot to help you out. How good am I? Um, right, okay, but that took a while, didn't it? Jesus Christ, yeah, just take a photo of Snowbell, please. <laughs> I've had enough of cutscenes for now. Um, what was that he just threw at him? What? Wow, I'm impressed. You've gone up in my estimation. <laughs> Just a bit. Yeah, because that was really difficult. Move left and then click the X button. Good God. And it auto saves. At least that's the useful. Next photo to take. I need my lunch. This is a bird eating from one of those hanging food things in the garden. You know, I tried some of that stuff once. Too much like health food for me. To help you even more, this is your radar indicator. When you get a new hint, this will show you where to go. At the moment, this is pointing toward the bird feeder on the wall. Before you run off, remember, if you get stuck on a photo, then you can just open the book, choose a new one, and I'll give you a hint about it. Margolo will also be around to help, and I'll keep an eye on you in case you need me. This cat will self-destruct in five seconds. <laughs> eh, just kidding. Now, go on. Get on with it. So it sounds like the um, 
original voice actors aren't present, so that's a shame. I can talk to you, can I? Right then, Stuart. What can I help you with? Well, let's see what you got. They got air slate, snowball secret, inventory. Go for photo book, I guess. Okay, let's open the book. Let's let you yeah, then, the one I did. One already. What? What do you mean? This is one of you and Margolo at the skate park. To get there, use your bow to shoot the lock off the greenhouse door, if you haven't already. From there, you need to find the park and beat Margolo's skateboard challenge before she'll pose for the photo. Okay, after looking through all that and things, sorry that I had to cut ahead there. I'm just not exactly sure, you know, what I'm meant to be doing. I know I'm meant to be taking photos and things, but what, were those like hints or something for me to do? I don't know, also I can talk to, uh, that, whatever that is. Hello? A task giver medallion, Stuart. If you activate one of these, then a person will offer you a task to complete. Where is the bird? If you succeed, then you'll probably <laughs> Sounds like the voice saying it. Um, okay, fair enough. <laughs> right. Also, is there a way to, like, yeah, I was gonna say, is there a way to, like, pan the camera out? But it goes back in. Oh, that's a bit of a shame, isn't it? Oh well. Anyway, right. Let's have a look around here, then. Show it. There's a there's a fish there. Well, I suppose I am a mouse. So I was, <laughs> I was wondering why the fish is so big, but um, probably because I'm a little mouse. <laughs> that does make some sense in a way. All right. Anyway, what does this do then? That's a medallion that shows you can interact with a nearby object. Go on, see what it does. Okay, if you say so, I guess. Um, nearby object, huh? Oh, oh, this Turnham Fountain. Hmm? What does that do? Yay! <laughs> what did I accomplish there? What? Oh, oh, right. Okay, so I've got to go collect that and things. So it's kind of like a platformer, a 3D platformer, but one where it involves say, uh, solving puzzles and things. I don't know, man. I really do not know. I don't know what kind of game Harry GM12 has given me here, but never mind. Alright, so what's this do? Photograph Fountain. Alright, oh, I see. Well, I suppose we're being called Big Photo Avenger. This must mean that, um. Aha, I see. And then take photo, right? Yeah, I get it. <laughs> so basically, it's the life of a photographer, but as a mouse. That seems pretty cool. You got another photo. Obviously, I'm a natural director. Indeed. Why is Snowbell so cheery in this one? Where usually in the film he's actually a bit depressed and things. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Um, what? What do you mean? That's you and George. He's busy driving one of his car things around the garden. So to get his photo, you'll have to beat him in a race. Try not to get run over. Um, okay, if you say so. Fair enough. We should go do that then. Hello, George. <laughs> do you, uh, do you want to yeah, talk to him? There we go. Oh, so those things actually indicate something. Hey, George. How are things? Feel good, Stuart. Just practicing on my radio control quad bike. Oh my god, that has a horrible voice. Can I take a picture of you, George? Well, okay. But only if you beat my quad bike race. Do you want to give it a go? Uh, yeah, alright. Yes, that's what I'm doing, isn't it? That's why I talked to you in the first place, is it not? Okay, now how does this control? Is there any skid button or anything? Yeah, there is. Okay, there's an R1 button. I don't know whether that does the brake or anything. Good God, that is a really, really fast quad bike. Why am I not... I'm not catching up to it at all, am I? Maybe I need to do a tighter turn or something, but Jesus. Okay, come on. Over tight. There we go. But that thing then catches up. Get out of the way. Jesus. Hey, Reminds me of Road Rash a bit, except obviously Stuart isn't punching it off or anything. Oh man! Damn it! That, what kind of power slide was that? That was terrible. Come on. Quickly catch up to the quad bike and never take it, Stuart. Quickly. There we go. Oh god, I hate how every time you overtake it, they like say something, you just like shut up and what. I know they do like Mario Kart and things, but at least it's short to the point. <laughs> and... 
At least they have original voice actors, you know, with, um... Well, God damn it! I forgot the guy's name who voices Mario. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that guy. Oh dear. That was fantastic driving, Stuart. Thanks, George. Can I take your photograph now? Sure you can, little bro. Yay! I get to take a picture of the of you and things. These cutscenes are kind of a bit dead. If they had the original voice actors, maybe it would be a bit more interesting, but I don't know, I hate it when games do that. They have, like, movie tie-ins, and of course it's people doing impressions of the characters, which are actually pretty terrible. Oh yeah, you're right, I need to go get some flashes, don't I? <laughs> Whatever that means. Um, okay. Now, whereabouts would those flashes be? Oh right, um, I think it would be this one over here, would it not? Nope, maybe not. I forgot what the flashes look like as well. Great. Well, what a fun one of this is, guys. <laughs> also, there's a fish there. What does that do? What? This is our cat snack, Stuart. If you collect enough of these for Snowbell, then he'll open somewhere up for you so you can get another photo. Okay, fair enough. You sounded very enthusiastic about that. <laughs> right. Uh, flashy flash, where are you? All I need is one flash. <laughs> it's very slow to walk around as well. Like, is there any way to to speed up or anything? R1. Oh, oh, oh! I see. Clicking the R1 button gets me on my skateboard, does it not? And now it's Tony Hawk's. And oh, really? All right, you can also do kick flips then. Yep, it's Tony Hawk, but instead it's Stuart Hawk. <laughs> All right. Anyway, uh, flash de flash. Have I got flashes yet? I know it says zero in that, but I don't know. I'm gonna give it a go anyway. Flash de flash. Can I flash you? <laughs> I need to get some flashes for my camera. <laughs> that actually sounds pretty wrong. I'm gonna flash George. <laughs> hell. Oh man. Okay. Anyway, let's just continue doing kick flips across the here because why not? Also, hey, wait. That's a rail. Can I grind that? Yeah, look at this! Woo! It's freaking Tony Hawk! And I love me some Tony Hawk games and things. Oh, I see. So I have to, like, jump and then go on there now, do I? That's fair enough. That's cool. My question is, where did he get the skateboard? What, like, what, was it from a dollhouse or something? It might, might have happened in the film, but I really, really cannot remember at all. And also, I can jump in this thing, right? L let's just give it another go, shall we? I don't see why not. Um, oh wow, really? Is that it? Oh. Is there, there, surely there must be a way to jump or something and all that. I believe there was also... Yeah, there was! There was Stuart Little 2 for the PS1 and that. I think I'm ever playing a demo of it and actually really liking it. But, I don't know. Hello, what's this? It's a giant blimp. Can I enter it? I can, but what does it do? Wait, what? Da -da -da -da. Can it fly? Uh, oh, out. There we go. Oh, I see. We go up, up, and away like this. <laughs> uh, that's fair enough. Okay. Let's just fly around then and burst these balloons. Whatever the hell they do. I don't even know what the hell they do on this bit. This is weird. Alright. Um. So. What am I supposed to do with this blimp then? Like, what? Squared? Circle? Triangle probably gets me out of it, so I don't I don't want to do that. Unless maybe that's how I get up here and things. It just seems to be a massive open world that you just go around and take pictures. I kind of don't mind that, actually. This is pretty cool. Anyways. Hmm. Oh, wait, there's a flash. There's a flash right there. I could do that. Collect the flash. Aha, there we go. Except, did it actually... Did I collect it? <laughs> Wait, oh wait, oh! Oh, I see, yeah, sure, but I, I want to photograph George first, because, I don't know, I just did something for him, and I'm going to go, can I take a photograph, and then Stuart Little just buggers off and then does something else. How nice of him, eh? Hey, George! Jeez! Did I you take it? You better this one, too, Stuart. Hold on, I'm coming! Seriously? Wait, what? What does that do? What? 
All right. Oh, okay. That was like a timer going on. That wow, that camera's pretty advanced, isn't it? <laughs> and I think that's Stuart's camera as well. Let me know. Yeah, indeed, I did snowball. Shut up. All right. Wow, we're at 17 minutes. We're probably going to be here a while, so I'm just going to do one more thing in this place and then end it off. I reckon. This sprinkler in the flower bed. Do I really have to listen to Snowball telling me where to go and things? I might as well just be free, you know, and find all this out myself. Also, hello. He's just kind of sitting there, isn't he? All right. Can I ride this? I can. Awesome. Look at this. Way. This, this is cool, like, you get going vehicles and things. It does make you feel like a mouse, a lot, actually. And I don't know why, but the music, this place, reminds me a lot of Sheep, Dog, and Wolf. <laughs> I really don't know why. It just does. Also, hello, bird. What do you want? These poles that stick out from things are good for swinging on. Just jump at them. Just jump at them, yes. Jump at them, and then that way you cling on to it. So then you swim back and forth like this, and you click the X. Yes, I thought so. <laughs> you do not have to be condescending for me, game. So that's the word, condescending. I found a cat snack. I'm over here. <laughs> that's the, probably the most enthusiastic voice ever when you find an item. <laughs> it's even better than Zelda with the da 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 da. It's I found a cat snack. <laughs> Oh, that's just perfect. Mr. Stout. Mr. Stout. Hmm? <laughs> Stout! Well, we're in the garden, and it's a perfect day for some golf. Now, Stewie, if you can beat my score on the course, then you can take a photo of one of my golfing trophies. Or, if you want, you could just practice on this hole. Um, no. Because I'm, I'm going to be there a while, I reckon. <laughs> I might as well uh, do something else during that time. Good goodness me. <laughs> I don't really want to play golf, thank you very much. Maybe I will in my spare time or something if I played this game, but I'm really not too sure. Also, hello, what's this? Mr. Stout? No. Well, you know what? I'm just going to find a flash <laughs> and take a picture of the bird. Damn it, I forgot the bird's name as well, as it's like from... How old is the Stuart Little 2 now? Because I believe it was Stuart Little 2 that the bird made the first appearance. Even now, I think it was like in the early 2000s probably? Uh, no, I think it was 2004. Jesus, I don't, I don't even remember. <laughs> Alrighty, let's have a look around here. Also, what's that? Water plant? What? What? I think the hose is lined up. Yay! So now I get to spray flowers, is that right? right. Then I choose That's this one over here. I think we're right. So what does this do actually? Does it just... I think it just That's gives me flashes. Uh -huh. Oh, I get it. So after collecting a bunch of these yellow things, this makes another flash, right? Yeah, it does. Because look, those things go up, don't they? Therefore, the more yellow things I collect, the more it goes up. Yeah, that's fair enough. Okay, cool, I got this and things, but... Wow, wow, wait, what? <laughs> fair enough, I'm just gonna change in and out of it, am I? That'd be cool. Wow, we're at 21 minutes. Okay, I'm just gonna do one more thing, because otherwise this is gonna drag on a bit, as this is quite a gigantic overworld. Use the cannon, why not? And now what? Whoa, my goodness me. Yay! <laughs> and also I got a flash anyway. Actually no, I'll tell you what I'll do, I'll take a picture of the bird really, really quick. Then I'll end it, because I at least want to end it with a picture of something. And where's the bird? Nice to see someone besides Snowbell enjoying their food. There we go. I did it! <laughs> wow, you're really happy about that, Stuart, aren't you? <laughs> Jesus. Another photo. I can barely contain myself. Right. And also auto save it on every single photo, because why not? Which one shall I send you off to do next? I'm not sure. But my guess is like each world net has basically these photos for you to do. And honestly, Go find I do rather like the layout of this. It's something that I would probably play myself and things. I don't know. I would have liked this as a kid though, I reckon. But um anyway, yes. 
let's just say uh, we'll end it off here then, yeah? This has been one of Let's Play's Blind Edition of Stuart Little Free Big Photo Adventure for the PlayStation 2, requested by Harry TM12. Take care, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I've enjoyed playing it, actually. It's actually not that bad of a game, really. My only gripe is that sometimes the camera's a bit annoying and the voice acting is terrible. <laughs> Still. Yeah, see you in the next one, guys. Woo! Oh my god, that's how you grind. You have to click X. It's just like goddamn Sonic Adventure. Sweet.